Hello everyone, my name is Apple Guy, and welcome back to the episode of my blind playthrough of Castlevania Symphony of the Night. In the previous video, we actually defeated three bosses, I think, here in the inverted castle. And in today's video, we are hopefully going to defeat some more bosses of the Upside Down Castle. We're making a ton of progress towards our goal of uh, presumably collecting the five Dracula parts. We need to uh, summon Dracula, and then we can defeat him once and for all. And, uh, you know, I was thinking, I was thinking how much progress we made in the last video and how close we were to, like, getting all the pieces of Dracula. Uh, but then I realized I have literally no clue where Dracula could be hiding. So even if we were to find all the pieces of Dracula, like, right now, I wouldn't know where to go to, to defeat him. So we'll have to, uh, well, we'll have to find him as well as find the parts to summon him. So we're not... Aw, oh, man, I took the wrong route. That's a shame. Can I get back? Oh, jeez. Yeah, in today's video, we're going to explore the towers a little bit over here on this side of the map. Uh, that's the plan for today's video. And it shouldn't be too tricky. I do want to make sure we get as much of the map filled as possible because that way we can get more uh, walk armor protection. And that's important to me. Darn it. I pressed the jump button, but it didn't work. Okay, so I guess we need to go up here then. Up and around. We'll just use the bat for it. Ooh, someone just fired a beam. Uh, it's another floor up. Right through here. Perfect. Alright, I'm going to use the wolf to go fast so that we can hopefully... Uh, oh, wait. Okay, maybe I won't use the wolf because I'm about to get in a spot of trouble. Okay, I should be able to charge the wolf now. If I don't get damaged. Okay. We'll figure this out, don't worry. We'll just jump over this guy. You know what? Mist sounds good. Yeah, we'll just use the mist. Okay, great. Don't mind me. Just gonna mist my way over here. Mist me! I haven't made that joke yet. That's a good one. Okay, so let me check the map one last time. Okay, so I want to make my way both down and over at the same time. Because there's a one little cube we missed and I need to get it because it'll bother me if I don't get it. So we'll, we'll head over there, we'll get that map mapped off, and then we will continue up the tower. Uh, like, map completion, I don't think is super important, because we can just go fight Dracula whenever we get the pieces. And the map is kind of more of like a personal thing at this point. Um, it's kind of like a thing I need to do for myself, more than for the game. Uh, okay, it's just a- yeah, there we go, we're fine. There we go, we can just fall through here, and that should map a certain portion. Perfect. Oh, there's a door over here. Let's explore- oh. Uh, actually, let's go- let's just do this first. Let's get this section done and dusted so that we don't have to worry about it. And then afterwards, we can- this should be the panther room, right? Oh, really, balloon pod? Okay. I was gonna salt it- oh, hey! Little petals. I was gonna salt it, because we still have the pinch of salt item. I haven't gotten rid of it yet. Okay, is it this room? It is. It's right over here. And it's filled. Perfect, okay. And now we go back. Alright, we did that mostly for my sanity, and also because it's like a little bit of walk armor progress. Okay, oh, and I'm out of charge. Eep! Get over there! Gosh darn it. There we go. Bits and pieces of progress. Okay. Nope. Okay. What is- what takes the least amount of power to use? The bat, maybe? There we go. Oh, I can make it with just a tiny little bit. Perfect. Thank you! Get up and in! Thank you for the knock. Oh, spike breaker armor is needed for this. Spike breaker armor right here. And- oh, I was gonna do this in spike breaker mode. But we need actually the mist to pass through here. Don't have enough power for it, we'll just break these. Alright, and don't mind me. Just misting my way through. So we'll break this. Hey look, the spike breaker tunnel is uh, not upside down. Just kidding, it's symmetrical along the, the axis. What is this? The Twilight Cloak? Black Cape for Vampires. Increases my con. And increase my defense by one. Sounds good to me. There we go. Ooh. Snazzy looking cape. 
Very cool. Ow! Oh, 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 jeez. I thought I had the Spike Breaker armor on still. Jeez. That's not good. That could have been worse. Okay. And we can go through here and we'll be fine. Okay, great. So that was a cool little area. Now we go up. We go up. And you know what, actually? Let's walk back into this room and let's use, like, a, a Mana Prism or something. Yeah, there we go. Uh, because I am... Oh, that says it restores all MP. It sure looks like it restored, like, 4 MP. Also, where'd my shield go? There it is. Not that I really even need the shield. Oh, it, it, it did restore it all. Okay. I just needed a moment. Oh, yeah, wait, hold on. I want to see what the bat looks like with the... With the new wings. Oh, that's fine. The sniper of goth. It's a goth sniper! Goth sniper down. It's like a classic bat. It's kind of cool. I think it looks better with colored wings, but I can't be too picky when I'm getting, you know, benefits like this of plus con and plus defense. Okay, there's demon enemies here. We want to avoid the demon enemies. I also want to kind of go up in like a zigzag pattern, I think. There we go. All right, we can go left and we can go right. Let's start with going left because I'm closer to the left. Oh, it's like, it's the upside down, uh, confessions booth. I can't confess. What if I go into this side of the confessions booth? Anything happen? Nope. Okay. Still weird Dracula's got a place like that in his tower, but, you know, fine, fine, I guess. Maybe he's just, maybe he stole the tower from someone. That'd be a very Dracula thing to do. All right, we can go through this way now. And continue to make some progress. Oh, hey, it's uh, it's the guy, it's the sword guy. It's the, the guy made of swords. We haven't seen him in a while. Good to make, good, good to know he's still existing here in this upside down version of the castle. Okay, I think this is the Colosseum. Which, I'm trying to remember. I think on the other side of this, like, upper area. Is that where the, the blue door was? There was a blue door that we couldn't go through. Uh, the first time we were in here in the regular castle. Oh no, this just links up to the... Okay, I'm not quite sure what I'm doing here. I don't know. There's got to be something of use over here, right? Oh, I thought I just broke the game. <laughs> I was like scratching my head trying to think. And I, I had one eye closed and the game stopped moving. I couldn't move and I was like, oh, just broke the game. But it turns out it was quite the... What am I doing? What... Am I getting heated? What is happening? I'm like angry? I don't know what that was. Don't mind me. I'll just be flying away if you need me. Oh wait, I need to get down here. There we go. Plotted it. Plotted it, son. Okay. Uh... What is that beeping noise? Is something going to explode? Is my friend going to explode? Oh no, it's like a conveyor belt? Oh, wait a sec. Yeah, we're gonna need a we're gonna need a moment here. Because this is the room This is the room where those uh like the cannonballs were in the first uh area. In the the, the correct the not upside down version. There's like all the cannonballs and it's, oh my gosh, release me. You're useless. No, hey. Hey, demon, can you get this guy? By any chance? Did you get the guy who's like locked onto me? No? Okay, fine. Did I get this area marked yet? Do I have to go over here to mark the area? There we go. Okay. Alright. Let's get- oh, no, I can't get the Imp of Goth. Or the, the Sniper of Goth, not the Imp of Goth. My apologies. That was not what I meant to say. I can get him now, though. Got him. Alright, we can go up here. I should use the bat. I think the bat uses less charge than the imp does. And that makes him a bit of a better choice. But obviously, we're not invincible as the bat. We're completely invincible as the... As the mist. That's just what the mist does best, is that whole invincibility thing. Speaking of mist, accidentally just activated it. That's gonna be a little costly. Let go of me! Not, I'm not even gonna be. Oh, there we go. I was gonna say I'm not even gonna be able to get free of it 
until something hits me. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. Oh, hey. Thanks for lagging up the game a little bit. Get over here. Go away. Boom, boom. There we go. Got him. Go away. We're, we're doing it. We are very slowly but surely making our way towards the top. There we go. And we're picking up all sorts of shurikens and whatnot along the way. Just need to duck into here. Continue going up. And we've reached the top slash bottom of this tower. I need to chart this area. There we go. Miss me. Okay, that's time I walked right into you. Oh, he's... Okay, you know what? We'll find a save point sooner or later, right? I keep getting... Oh, level up. Nice. I keep getting these Zircons that I'm just never going to use because I don't... I'm not going to go back to the library to sell them. You know? I don't know where the library is on this map, but I know where the save room is. We can save some progress. Always a fan. Locking it in. Making sure. Oh, we almost have 400 health. I was, I was gonna say making sure in the event of catastrophe we will not lose too much progress like we did back in the first episodes of the series. Now we're pretty uh pretty safe. Okay. This is not was this the, oh this might be the super long hallway that crosses like the entire castle. Uh you know what? I think I actually want to keep the pinch of salt. Thanks, but no thanks, bottle of water. I'm all good. The pinch of salt and I are getting along just fine. It's not perfect, but it'll do. Ah, uh, this is a familiar sight for sure. Hey, axes, same deal. Kind of in, kind of got a exclusivity deal with the pinch of salt. So, gonna keep that, uh, keep that going. Okay. Oh boy, it's those ice ladies that were in the. Uh... Oh, just dropped in and dropped out. But the ice ladies that were in the the caves in the, the first area. The El Salem witches, I guess. I thought they were illusionary somethings. Oh, these aren't the, the ice ladies. Never mind. Hey, look, it's another save room. Gonna go ahead and not save because I just did. And I'm feeling... I feel like risking it for the biscuit. Okay, uh, let's go over here. I think these lead to the same place. Oh, they do not. Sure, I'll fight a boss. Oh yeah, this is where we fought- oh my lord, it's Beelzebub! Oh my gosh, what has the devil put aside for me? What does Beelzebub even look like? Should I even see? Oh, I'm poisoned. Is it even worth seeing? I'm kind of curious. Eh, weird. Kind of weird. Okay, I want to hit him from like- up, I guess? I don't know what my plan is. Let me salt the ground so that his little worms can't get to me. Okay, th what is the plan? Do I snipe him as the bats? Can I leave? Oh no, I can't. I was like, can I? Uh, huh. Okay, so Mr. Beelzebub, first off, uh, a lot of damage, sir. I could javelin him. Oh, let's, we're gonna blow him up. That's what we're going to do. Okay. Here's the plan. We're going to get in and blow him up. Get him! I don't even think it worked. That's such a shame. Uh, We'll take a high potion because I need it. And then we will get our shield back and use it a little bit. Okay. I need to deal some more damage to Mr. Mr. Bub. Oh, if I had the knives or the axes, that I could do a lot more damage than I'm doing right now. Because I could actually hit him. Oh yeah, hold on tight, uh, demon. Get him. Okay, let's salt the ground a little bit. Okay. A little bit swarming happening on here. There we go. Okay. Oh, hold on. You know what would be great if I could do the moons thing right about now? But I don't know how. Hi. I'll be over here if you need me. Just gonna have a snack, I think is my plan. Yeah, just gonna need a bit of a snack. What's some food that I can use? Well, we'll eat the dim sum. Okay, that was a pretty terrible 
restoration food. We'll eat a, a hot dog. Again, pretty awful restoration food. Don't I have the meal tickets? We'll drop a meal ticket. We'll see what happens. Feed me! I ate peanuts. And cheesecakes? What? This game. This game. A difficult to eat item? Well, I, I don't even think I ate the. Oh my gosh, this game. Gives me a peanut item, and I can't even use it. Okay, yeah. Yes. Uh, knives would be real nice right about now. Although, the pinch of salt, like, does. Ah, uh, gosh. Okay. Hold on. We gotta get our health in order. A turkey? Let's snack on a. It's a full turkey for 80. Sure. Let's drop a karma coin. What happened? Tails. Oh, wait, hold on. I need to do it under here. I flipped a karma coin. Come on, karma coin. Tails! That was kind of cool, but I don't know if it did anything. Alright, I'm kind of done messing around. Let's get something... Like a javelin, I guess? Nope, this one. Yeah, that's the boss right there. Okay, we hit him for a little bit of damage. Uh, let's do, like, a hit-and-go strategy, I guess. There we go. Okay, nope, we're gonna lose. Uh, I'm gonna double high potion right about now. High potion. And high potion. Okay, we win this now. Probably need one high potion, in all honesty. Um... What else can I do? Yeah, I guess I should just stop messing around. I should just get in there and hit him when I have the opportunity to. Which is not very often. Where's my shield? There it is. Alright, yeah, so we will just fly in with the mist. And when he's unattended by flies, we'll just, we'll just hit him. Like right now. Oh, I don't even think I hit him. Okay, yeah, the poison... Thanks. You're, you're putting in work here, Familiar. I appreciate it. I am actually doing the opposite of work. I'm just getting wailed on. Okay, there we go. There we go. That was good. Nice. Now that I have the position that I need, I can just keep going in. There we are. Oh, we're fine. Yeah, it's a little bit cheesy, but we can, we can get him this way. Yeah, we just have to basically spawn in. And then slap him. There we go. I'm about to run out of mana, though. There we go. Got him. Okay. That was a little cheesy. I'll be honest. That one was a little bit cheesy. But we get... A life max up. We're over 400 health now. So that's pretty cool. Uh, but no, uh, no piece of Dracula for that one. Okay, that room has a couple of exits. Uh, no axe. Although, probably should have used the axe for that fight. It would have been useful. The assault wasn't great. Um, but the familiar was good. And I got to use the mist in kind of like a cheesy way. So that's fine. It works. We did good. And now we get to save the game. Lock in that progress. And we can continue going through... And just knocking out these bosses as we find them. They are not particularly common. I mean, we did three of them in the last video, and we found one in today's video, so... Not entirely uh, super consistently findable, I guess I, I mean to say. Um, and then there should be an exit up here as well, right? I think? This would have been the entrance in the correct castle? Yes, it looks like there is something right here. Okay, great. So that takes us one way, and there's another exit down here, which would be... Um... Oh. The Ring of Arcana. Well, tell me about it. Increases rare item appearance? I guess, like, drops? I don't really need drops. I know from a comment way early on in the series that there are, uh, like, different items you can find. That sometimes you have to defeat 
uh, an enemy and it's, it happens, it's like a chance to spawn. Uh, so I know that rare drops are a thing. They do exist. But I don't... Oh, I heard the fire guys. That's going to be a fun room. I don't know if there's any of them that I need right now. I mean, obviously they're all good. Or maybe they're not all good, but they're, they're pretty decent. I don't know if I need any of them right now, though. What's through here? Another hallway. Speaking of right now, I think I'm going to end off this video right now because we, we are at another save room and we beat it. We beat it. We beat a boss in this video, so we made some progress. And, uh, you know, we're in a new spot of the castle. We're just going to keep going through, checking things off. I'm not sure what my plan is for the inverted castle. I don't know if I'll get, like, a lot of the map completion or if I'll just try and find Dracula straight away. Um, we'll have to see as the as the game progresses a little bit further. Uh, that's going to be all for now, ladies and gentlemen. So I want to thank you all so, so much for watching. If you have enjoyed, please hit like and subscribe and tell your friends about my channel if you think they would enjoy it. It means a lot to me when you guys spread my videos around. And I'll catch you guys all back here next time for my next video. Until then, as always, take care.